Hi. Hey, how's Hi. it going? Thank you for having me. Absolutely. Thanks for coming all the way across the ocean to yeah. wander out here, warm up a little bit. Well, I'm excited to see what you think about Kappa and what it, I don't know, maybe you give me ideas too. I looked at some of I your know, work yeah. and yeah. it's like, wow, how can I, hmm, that's the first thing, right? You look at people's work and go, now how can I do something like that, what I'm doing? But I want to hear about what you do. Oh yeah, what do I do? Yeah. Well, I guess I work with paper, our company, Confetti System. I started with my partner. Yeah, it ranges from like set design um, to like design for our friend's shop to just like online orders and stuff, like one pinata or like mm -hmm. one garland, mm -hmm. kind of like working with materials that are just like art supply materials. Mm -hmm. So I love that you make, you're making it from like the ground up. Mm. It's crazy. Like that's the dream for, <laughs> that's the fantasy for me anyway. So your yeah. Beyonce job, I mean, how does one... <laughs> oh yeah, the Beyonce end up job. doing something for Beyonce. There is Beyonce. Does she want Kappa, do you think? <laughs> she would. Oh my God, I'm, I'm sure she would. She would look amazing in Kappa. Um, What's interesting to kind of look at is that the tree itself is from Asia. So it was brought from people who migrated from there. Okay. When they came, they brought the, the kappa, they brought the tools and the wow. methodology. Okay. And then as they stopped at some island and said, well, this is a great place, we'll stay here. Uh -huh. Stay there, then some, then some group of them says, you know what, we're gonna keep going. But then when you look at how different everything is, yeah. there's like no vestige of this to this, mm -hmm. you know, that connects them. But everything came from one source. So that was a really long time historically that people stayed in different islands, worked this thing, and then went somewhere else and then started doing something different. Wow. In Hawaii, we really stopped. So for a long time, people didn't even know what Hawaiian kapa looked like unless you saw it in the museum. So you're going to use your candy shell and we're going to scrape off there's this brown layer then there's a dark green layer then there's a light green layer we're trying to get to the white layer oh okay and you're doing more workshops i do well when i started doing this i started as a teacher and um the place i worked for that hired me had had developed a whole curriculum to do the, exactly what we're doing in the schools oh. with fourth graders oh, okay we're gonna take our cool shark tooth knives, our niho mano, and we're gonna make a cut through this skin. Now, if you look okay. at the end of it, you can see about how, how thick the skin oh, yeah. is. Kind of get in there, and you're just gonna drag it right along all the way to the end. One of the other cool things about teaching this is that people, I don't know, you know, people are just so far removed a lot of times from this kind of stuff that when, when you use a shark tooth and cut it and then peel the bark off a tree, people are always like, Wow, that's amazing. So like this one is Kawila. It was one that they used. One of my friends made that one. I'll just use that one. Mm, Actually, you. this one might be Kawila too. Pound right down the center. You're not really gonna see anything happen, but just go slow. And we're just kind of breaking up that fiber so we can fold it. So you can see you're making kind of a imprint on there, right? Okay. Yeah. Now we're gonna fold this. So you start from this very top part up here and that has to open. So hit it hard enough that something's happening. I, cool. I kind of try to be less a slave of the color I think it should be and more embrace the colors that I have. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and you know, doing that kind of stuff. I mean, I know people who, who were just very, um, has to be native, has to be Hawaiian, has right. to be this and that. But you know, Hawaiians didn't have any problem integrating in all the crazy new things that came. They're like, I like that, I'm gonna use it. Mm -hmm. That's cool, that helps, we're gonna do it. Mm -hmm. And then these take a really long time to print because the method is to print everything shoulder to shoulder. Oh, so the printing is like that. And when you print, you can't even, you don't even know what the stamp was. Ooh, wow. Yeah. When they're all touching cool. like that because now you come up with the designs in the, in the negative space uh, as well. Oh my God, wow, cool. The method is put it down. Press that whole thing, pick it up. Okay, okay. yeah, we're gonna do okay. okay. You know, people, everyone looks for, what does it mean? Mm. See, you guys have, you guys stuff is so abstract, people aren't gonna ask you, is there a hidden meaning in this? Are you trying to tell a story in True. this? Yeah. yeah, here's the story, la, ah, happiness, this party. <laughs> no. Rows of the 50 trees. So these are one year old? Yep, yep. And see, and then you see how they just, start spreading out from the roots. 
Yeah, but this, it's still, you see how it's still green. It's still a little bit young. Oh, right. I like that you're so honest about um, not knowing, you mm. know? Like, that's amazing because, yeah, it's honest. I think there's so much mystery around like art and mm -hmm. makers and. Um, it's a, a time, you know, the time and the patience that you need. And, and that's for any art, you know, and, yeah. and it's for so many of the mediums too. I mean, people who carve marble, people who pour, you know, um, metals and mm -hmm. work copper and all that kind of stuff. You, you are essentially at the mercy of that material. Yeah. Because those materials all have their own mind. But for us, I guess there is something, um, you know, timeless about it's the repetition that you put into something mm -hmm. that is like we both do very repetitive work. Yeah, yeah. Um, and you know, and that's the thing, and that's the thing people are losing. Yeah. The ability to sit very still, do right. the same boring thing yeah. over and over again. Yeah, there is something beautiful about yeah having that mind. Like we have that yeah. mind in common, even yeah. though we do such different things. But okay, so I have this kappa for you. Oh my God. To figure out some crazy thing to do in your work. And so you can see that the, this watermark in it, that's a very Hawaiian something about it. If you ever find a piece of kappa and you're in doubt, then just hold it up to the light and see if all this pattern and stuff is beaten in and you will know it's It's Hawaiian only Hawaiian. Kappa. Man, okay, it's beautiful. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you. Absolutely. <laughs> oh, so glad to meet you. Yeah, you too. You oh. know, I live out here at the end of the world. I don't meet many people. I don't have many <laughs> friends. Or people just wander out here when I'll they're come lost. Back, for sure. Please do. Yeah. yeah.